my dearest friends, thank you for watching. I'm Kaya Singamari from Heart to Heart and you're here because you have chosen this painting and this intuitive guidance reading <laughs> for the new moon coming up on the 23rd of February in Pisces. And as you see, I hope you can see it well. If not, you can see it better on my Facebook page and on Instagram as well. This is of gold, this is golden heart, the golden strings, this gold. Here we have a lot of gold. I was I was asked to paint with a lot of gold this time and all the artworks I made for the for this new moon. What I found interesting is gold is for me uh, representing the divine masculine and silver the divine feminine. So all this gold showing up in my paintings um, is for me a sign that the divine masculine starts to show up as well. Not just in the next two weeks, but I, I've got the feeling this year they will really come closer. For sure, when I talk about divine masculine, it's on one hand uh, I talk about men, and on the other hand our divine masculine parts and our self coming more in alignment with the Divine Feminine. It's really beautiful as well. So, the energies of this new moon will unfold until the next full moon in Virgo on the 8th, 8th of March. And maybe longer, but I think about this, this is time they will be on their highest points. And it becomes emotional. This is already my uh, second recording because I'm, as I told you, I'm in Germany at the moment and I'm so, the light is here so great. <laughs> see, really, when I see the videos I made in France and here, it's always, the German videos are so grey. <laughs> I don't like it. A lot of shadows of grey, grey shadows, grey and a bit grey, a bit more grey and less grey light. It's winter as well, so... And the last video was so great that I decided to make it for another time. As ever, I will read you the informations coming through while I was painting. I have written them down. And, yeah, enjoy. This new moon is about flowing like the waves with all what shows up. All this heaviness from this and other lifetimes. All this heaviness you feel in your whole system. All that heaviness that has shown up in the last months. You know it so well. It holds you on earth, it grounds you, and it holds you back from flying as well. There are days you have the feeling that it will never end. That it doesn't matter how much you purge and clear and work on yourself. There's still so much heaviness remaining. Does it never end? It will, my love, it will. Don't give up, trust. You are shortly before a big shift. This new moon, with its sensitive and highly emotional energies, will let you feel the heaviness again. You might feel like drowning in it. Don't give up, trust. This is needed to finally let go the biggest part of this heaviness as if it is needed to feel the full weight for a last time, to really appreciate the lightness following, coming in your life and your whole system. <clears throat> you are undergoing such a profound transformation at the moment. You are healing so many and so old wounds and trauma. You are doing so well. You are so strong. You are amazing. So, when you feel like buried under the waves of the emotions coming in now, dive in your heart and breathe. Breathe deep in and let go while you exhale. Feel. Let the tears flow when needed, cry and shout when needed. Don't distract yourself. Don't let yourself be distracted. Don't run away. Feel. Go through it. Let yourself have the feeling and the experience that you can breathe underwater. 
that you feel the ground under your feet under water as well that you don't die and flush away by these waves of emotions stay and let yourself have the experience know how it feels when the wave has passed by when your head comes out of the water first then your whole body purified clean and so light feel yourselves dancing feel the joy arising not any longer suppressed by this heaviness feel this immense freedom you deserve so much and the peace see all these old emotions and traumas floating away with the waves say goodbye and thank the waves that they came to take your heaviness with them thank yourself that you have stayed that you know about your strengths thank yourself and feel the sun warming your skin feel that you can move now feel the lightness in your whole system feel your wings opening discover what comes up what was hidden under this heaviness the universe has so many beauty prepared for you so much fun so much being yourself in a way you don't know yet you never have experienced so much beauty and depth your heart so open for the beauty of life for the funny things as well You can burst into tears because you're touched by the beauty of a flower or a little puppy. Because your heart is fully open. Because this beauty you see feels so sweet. Maybe you laugh in the next moment. Maybe you laugh in the same moment. No more heaviness. Just being touched and the natural re reaction out of your heart. The flow of emotions like waves now in your system. Coming and going, coming and going. As they are now internalized, they are no longer threatening for you. It feels natural like your heartbeat, like breathing. It's just feeling, being alive in the present moment, innocent like a child, crying in one moment, laughing in the next one, steady and flow. You are a human being with a beautiful soul and heart. You have the capacity to feel, as this is one of the big gifts to mankind. So do it. Feel. No longer any resistance. No judgments, just acceptance of all showing up. You become the wave. You are the wave. Moving on, holding for a moment, moving back. And relaxing, naturally. Not any longer the need to control, not yourself, not another one. As you are free now. As you are able to welcome whatever shows up now. So be. Be the ocean. Be the wave. Feel the freedom. Feel the joy. Laugh and dance. Be. And laugh. <laughs> I realized that to laugh, laughing and loving are... Uh, I just don't, I pronounce it equally, so it sounds like laugh and laugh. Maybe a native English speaker would, there's a little, little fine difference. Well, I like this reading um, and there are a lot of information for me in as well. I hope it has resonated for you. And as ever, if you uh, feel you would like to give a comment, I love to read your comments. I really appreciate a lot of um, reading them and yes I highly recommend to listen to my um, general energy update for this moon as well because it's all about feeling and the heart really just the heart heart opening how we can stay open with our hearts and letting the love flow like waves as well in and out and in and out And yes, it's still challenging, it's still intense, not, not any longer that heavy than last year, but, well, <laughs> intense. And if you have the feeling um, you would like to contact me to get a personal reading, to get a session, to have a look, deeper look what's going on in your personal life and, and 
to clean and purge out a little bit there, contact me. You feel, you feel. I always say feel when I will say find. It's interesting because it's about feeling. It's all about feeling at the moment, not any longer thinking. It's just feeling. So you find all the um, informations where and how you can contact me here and on Instagram in the description box below. On Facebook it's above. And in any case, I wish you the best. Go with the waves. Flow with the flow. <laughs> and I send you all my love.